yeah. Fuck, Civil Contract. You guys remember Civil Contract? Of course you do, dude. They released like a demo or something and I haven't opened it yet. I uh, unrawed it. It was a 20 gig raw. Like, I don't know how. Let's have a look. Downloads. Uh, civil contract. 21 gig raw. What the fuck is that? Let's see how big it is when it's unrawed. Fuck me. Yeah, so we could open up that and see what's going on there. Because uh, if you guys haven't been, you know, paying attention here at uh, Role Player Enterprises, we've been very excited for the epic release of Civil Contract soon. Check out the demo whilst waiting. Civil Contract demo. On behalf of SMT, I would like to release the demo for Civil Contract. This demo is only a taste test for what is to come and what our team, Enter Enter, has been working on for the past year. This demo does not require any payments. I swear to God, it's got to be like a fucking Bitcoin miner or some shit. I, I just don't understand how, how all of these announcements are so fucking, like, dribbly. Like, we can we can go through and, 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 and you know, find all the errors in it. Let's do that quickly. I mean, first of all, why the fuck is it underscored? I? No. Why is there a comma and a, a, a capital letter? I don't know. Same thing here. And why is there a fucking double enter here? Like, I just don't understand it. So you literally, like, fucking gets his cat to write these fucking news announcements. But yeah, this demo came out two years, uh, not two years ago, two days ago. So let's go ahead and open it up. See what happens. Copyright 2019. Why does it say copyright 2019 in the bottom left? Does that even mean anything? So you have to like put like more words other than just copyright 2019? Like. Why do you call himself SMT? It's a game, not a server. Because they're armor players and they don't really know what the fuck SMT means, but they know it sounds cool. So we're trying to sound cool, basically. That's what they're doing. Alright, let's try us out. I don't know. So I don't think, uh, dude, I'm just scared like an IP is going to pop up on the screen or something, man. This is the scariest thing I've ever seen. So there's no multiplayer servers right now. So all there is is the demo. We're going to press play demo. I mean, yeah, there's a reason I clicked on the little demo button, mate. So this is the civil contract demo. You guys remember me talking about this game a few months ago, saying it was a scam, potentially, for, you know, just a lot of dribble being, um... Communicate to the world. So this is the, the next generation of roleplay games, guys. Welcome to the demo. Okay. So what can we do in the demo? I don't really know. Okay, I put glasses on, I guess. Test clothing. I guess it kind of works. So you got like four shirts you can put on. What else can we do? Let's go in the police department. Now that you're on duty, you will see that you can see on the top of your screen some useful information because of a code for the armory. That's, wait, sorry, the armory. So you can get some equipment. <laughs> what the fuck? There you guys can see the code in the top left right there. No, I mean, that's a problem with this game, but I just don't get. Like, I mean, it doesn't seem terrible, right? Like, you know, it, it could be worse, but it's like, why does no one, like, spell check any of this shit, man? So there's an alarm here. I don't know how the fuck that works.
This is armory. Grab your weapon and <laughs> your ammo. Also have a look at the mods. When GG. your mom thinks you are gaming, but you are really kidding your steps, sis. Well, how do I reload? I gotta open it. What is this, Daisy? Like, what, what's the point of opening it? <laughs> I mean, let's be real though. What's what's better, this game or identity? It's just like so floaty, you know. So I don't know what else there is to do in the demo, but this game's been delayed like fifty fucking times. Press F. Um, What's well, a light which like only works like? <laughs> Let's see if we can press the alarm over here. Tango unpekenio penne jaja jaja. End of demo zone, play zone, okay. But yeah, I mean, so we're gonna be releasing this game on Steam really soon. With multiplayer, apparently. Um, there seems to be about as much to do in this game as there is an identity. Uh, I think it costs like $30 or something. I, I don't know, why is there an armory code? Nice hair. But, I mean, how did someone release this? Like, how did they release this demo and be like, yeah, this is good? Like, did no one, like, check it and be like, yo, there's no fucking fall there? Yo, all the English is scuffed. I swear I recognize those sounds. I don't know where from, but from, though. There's an invisible wall here. Can we go inside here? What the fuck? But this is what I was excited for, man. I really just wanted to see, like, you know, what works and what doesn't. For some reason, there's lights on at daytime. This is cool worths. Has anyone played this demo in chat? Being and drinking is from Rust. If you have played it, what else is there to do? Like, am I missing anything? I think I can rob the bank or something, apparently. I have nothing else to do now. So you can't do anything else? You can't like withdraw from an ATM, you can't rob a bank. No? Oh. So, yeah, if you guys want to buy this on Steam, it's $30 and you can, I don't know, go shoot people or something. Can I want to go watch a trailer for this game again? Oh my god, my eyes. I mean, yeah, it was pretty much obvious anyway, but in case you guys thought this game wasn't a scam, you know, like everyone does the same thing with identity, it's like, it's not a scam, just give him a few years. I know this game. Yeah, you know, this game is also definitely a scam. Um, I mean, it's kind of good that we did. What the fuck? It's kind of good that we did release a demo instead of forcing people to buy it to to get access to it. But more places to go than identity. There's just so much scuffed shit in it, though. 
Why does it look like a Desert Eagle in the toolbar yet when you get the gun it's an M9? Apparently his PayPal's been shut down due to PayPal receiving multiple reports. Uh, it sounds like rumor on the street. But um, yeah, there's no working vehicles in right now, but like apparently there will be eventually. It's just like, I don't know, the, the core game isn't like terrible. It's like, a, I see potential with the basis. I mean, I know it's not gonna go anywhere, but it's like, why can't I fucking sprint anymore? Do we need glasses on to sprint or something? How is this 20 gigs? It's 30 gigs. It's 28 gigs, dude. <laughs> I, I physically have no idea how this game is 30 gigs. Like 30 Nineteen gigs of what? Fucking. Show me some love, sil sil Yeah, I, I don't know how this game is 30 gigs. I mean, that in itself is kind of a red flag. Like a game that's in like early access or whatever, that's 30 gigs, that has this little content, kind of says the devs have got no idea what the fuck we're doing. But I mean, this much was already obvious, so. Alright, anyway, that's the uh, civil contract, guys. There's nothing else to see here. I just want to watch it quickly so I can uh, compare what I just played with the uh, with the trailer. Just so I can really get a good feel for it. I like how here, there's a fucking chair and like a suitcase and loads of shit in the middle of the road. <laughs> and also the floor has no texture here. <laughs> this, this trailer released a few months ago as well, it's a funny thing. What's like here, it looks pretty epic, right? But obviously like, these scenes that they made were just rigged scenes. I mean, this much was obvious, you even see this guy disappear here. See, so he just disappeared. We haven't really seen if like VoIP works, which is really important as well. Here we do have the police department with actual police officers, which we didn't have an actual thing. There's also an M- Like what kind of police station just has a fucking M9 sitting on the counter? You know what I mean? He got his hands crossed and it's just an M9 chilling out there. Sounds like a PD raid just waiting to happen. Real play. Risky, but be ready to face the consequences. Like, what even? Where's this asset from? Is it AI or will it be actually pl actual, actual players? It's supposed to be actual players. I mean, as you've seen at the start, it says an MMORPG or some shit. There's a prison. Apparently, there's a bit of open worldness. Apparently, but like, none of this stuff's actually really in game. Like, we, we wouldn't even need to do that much to make this game like that much better, you know? Like, clearly, we've got some kind of decent shit going on, but instead. It's just a bunch of fucking dribble. Um. Wall had preview wall mark on the police station? Wait, did it? Where? Oh, ha ha ha!
Wait, is that in the... I want to see if that's in the game. I want to see if that's in the game or not. Wait one second. That's fucking hilarious. I love it when these shit fucking games release so. Especially a shit roleplay game, it's amazing. Civil Contract is the best game ever to grace the face of the planet. I feel like it's gonna be like lots of dribble here as well, but I can't be fucked to read it, read through all of it, but you know, I played demo, yes. Wait, this is a police station here. Wait, we've changed the police station. Yeah, this is a different police station, so I guess... And just speak to officer, but and then you, you the weird thing is your your mouse is still moving when you're speaking to officer, but like there's no officer there and my mouse is still moving. I mean, how can we help you, sir? Are you looking at joining the force, or perhaps you're you're here for another reason? Like, who the fuck says that in a police station? Oh, you're right, mate. You want to join the police force, or maybe here for another reason? I, I don't know. I don't, you're on duty. Welcome. Now that you're on duty, you will see that you can see on the top. Left of your screen, some useful, with two L's, information, including the code for the Amory, so you can get your equipment upstairs. Like, okay, so here's the thing. The top left Armory code doesn't do anything. The Armory is not upstairs. It's downstairs, right here. Like, and why the fuck is the shotgun shells here, but there's no shotgun? One sec, can I put a red dot on this? Yeah, I'm sure this wasn't taken from fucking some random, uh, is this Mickey game made on uni or UE? It's UE, isn't it? Some random UE fucking store thing. Wow, that sounds like does a really good job of keeping it silent. Well, you literally can't even fit inside the fucking jail. Well, not the jail, the whatever you call this. What is that? I'm not gonna lie though. The like roleplay experiences that have came out of Australia, not very impressive. Maybe things are different over in Australia. Are we just ARs on the wall or shotguns too? Uh, on the wall? I mean, here these are just assault rifles. I mean, like, things kind of work, but the thing is, I know for a fact of this, you know, inventory system was probably, this is probably bought from the store as well. So, like, the inventory system, like, works, I guess. I don't know if in multiplayer and shit, you can probably just fucking dupe, like, no, tomorrow we can't go on the bike. There's no NPCs here as well, like, I don't know why we didn't put NPCs or something here. And, like, the clothing, like, what the fuck is that clothing model on the floor? Why do I have any pants? Is there any pants here? I can't even go third person anymore. Just to confirm, I'm getting like 20 FPS right now. Alright, well that's it. Yeah, it's already done now. I just wanted to give it a good shot, and it was really good. Thanks for watching that one, guys. It was awesome. It was just as good as I expected it to be. So yeah, Civil Contract. I do have it on Steam, so you know, I'll play, I'll play it on release.